Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you a few places where you can get data entry jobs as a beginner that will pay you on a weekly basis. So if you're looking for something like this, you can check a website called OneSpace. What you can do is go to freelance.onespace.com, scroll down a little bit, and usually they'll have some freelance positions open. Now, they have something like a transcriptionist right now, which is pretty much the same thing as data entry. You're just typing stuff that you hear in an audio file into complete sentences and then submitting it. Um, but if you want things like spreadsheets and stuff, you might just check back every once in a while. They don't seem to have one for that type of data entry related right now, but they do have graphic design, image design, and transcription, which again, transcription is very similar to data entry, and you could make the argument that it's a branch of that. But uh, you can do these in all sorts of languages, and you basically don't need any kind of experience, but you may need to know your word per minute typing speed for any kind of data entry job. So I recommend you go to typingtest.com or another site and test your typing speed in words per minute as well as accuracy. So make sure you know that before applying at OneSpace or other places like that. The next one is smith.ai. If you go to smith.ai slash careers, this is a place where you can get uh, some jobs where they're kind of like virtual assistant type jobs. You will have to spend some of your time on the phone though and uh, part of it might be data entry and then part of it's gonna be like reception type work. So it's again, basically a virtual assistant type of job, but you get paid 10 to $11 per hour and you do need a 40 word per minute typing speed and they do provide uh, benefits though. So medical, dental and vision insurance, retirement plans, cash bonuses and paid training are all included with this type of job. You can also check a place called Quick Worker. Quick Worker has data entry related jobs of all sorts, uh, whether it's transcription or whether it's typing stuff into spreadsheets. They also have other things like categorizing data, uh, text creation, editing, copy, and uh, research, proofreading, all sorts of stuff. So they have a lot of different types of work that's kind of like the same level as data entry. So um, you don't really need experience to apply here. You don't really need any kind of degree or anything, but it's a great way for you to make some extra money, about nine to $10 per hour via PayPal. They also pay you weekly and uh, you can find some uh, decent data entry jobs here. Now, another place that kind of specializes in just data entry is SigTrack.net. Now, they currently aren't accepting new users, which probably has to do with the whole pandemic and all of that. But hopefully, because the site's still up, you should be able to find jobs again in the future because they still have this page available. Um, but what you would do is when they start hiring again, they look for data entry people. They will pay you via PayPal and you get $3.70 per signature, $15 per registration that you complete. Um, and it depends on accurate and stuff as well, but what you're, going, what you're going to specialize in is voter data and things like that. So you'll be doing things related to petitions, voter registration, and things like that, and you'll get paid weekly via PayPal. Again, it's going to depend when they start accepting applicants again. This year's been kind of weird for a lot of sites but um, SigTrack.net is one to keep an eye on at least for the future. And then last but not least is uh, Figure8 slash Appin. So normally I would tell you to go to the Figure8 website, but it'll just redirect you back to Appin, which I guess acquired Figure8 not too long ago. So Appin is a site that has all sorts of online jobs, um, but you can get paid to do micro tasks, daily checklists, all sorts of data entry and other things like search engine evaluation and stuff. Uh, transcription, those types of jobs via PayPal. And you can become an Appin contributor just by going to appin.com slash jobs and becoming a contributor. And that is where you can start getting paid to do these types of jobs. Now, it's kind of similar to like ClickWorker or something like that. So you have transcription, categorization, you know, data entry. They have a, just a, a variety of jobs kind of like that where you can do this as a beginner without experience. So um, other than that, again, you get paid via PayPal. It's from Figure 8. Figure 8 does still have a website, but you will get redirected here to Appin now. So that's kind of an update with that. So hopefully this was helpful. Just to give you a few websites to check out. I know a lot of you are, keep asking me about data entry, and so these are a few 
that I would recommend if you want to get paid very quickly. There are others out there that might take a little bit longer to pay you. And I would also check out my other videos related to data entry, typing, and transcription because it's all pretty much the same general level of uh, what you're going to need as far as skills. Your fast word permit, typing speed, accuracy, and uh, pretty much working completely just typing. So those are a few different levels of that and a few websites you can check out that pay you weekly. Hopefully this was helpful and I'll see you in the next video.